welcome back to another YouTube video. I hope you guys are doing well. I've basically been on a roll with creating content this past week. Like, I've had so many exciting things um, happen and um, you guys probably would have seen the video but I had a box swap with Shannon which I absolutely enjoyed. Um, I've got a new item in my collection that I want to show you guys as well which I'm obsessed with and I've basically started back at work the past couple of weeks so I've kind of got back into a routine and I'm just feeling really good at the moment like I've been back at the gym and trying to like eat a bit healthier and I've just been feeling really good so touch wood it lasts um, I've got my cup of coffee and I'm ready to film um, a beauty favourites video and a little what's in my handbag of cu a couple of like my makeup favourites because I've been really getting into my makeup lately and my skincare and just taking care of my face um, because I am 31 now so I'm ageing quickly and I really want to start looking after my skin. So I'm going to jump straight into this part of the video and show you my beauty favourites and my new Louis Vuitton Trues 23 that I recently purchased and I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you do, please give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you love anything beauty related, travel, makeup, um, lifestyle, just anything really. This channel I feel like is just a mixture of everything and planner content as well. I absolutely love planner content um, and I like to do a lot of what's in my hand handbag videos um, because I am a handbag holic. Like I just love buying handbags, especially vintage handbags. So yeah, if you love anything like that, then please give this video, um, I say give this video a like, but subscribe to my channel. And yeah, so I'm going to jump straight in and I hope you guys enjoy it. So I'm actually going to start with hair care because for the past like six months I want to stay, say, I've been really trying to look after my hair. So I've basically um, had a new hairdresser, which is one of Kieran's friends and her name's Izzy and she's incredible. Like she literally is a hair artist and she's been doing my hair the past like three times and I've been going blonder um, since being with her, but... I've tried to calm down putting bleach in my hair and I'm just sort of having a bit of blonde at the front and then leaving the rest quite natural. Um, but my my grey hairs do tend to grow through quite quickly. But there's been a couple of saviours for my hair because I basically am nat I have naturally curly hair. And when I mean naturally curly, I mean like ringlet curls. And don't get me wrong, there is absolutely nothing wrong with curly hair because I think curly hair is stunning unfortunately my hair just doesn't grow it gets to like my shoulder and then just stops growing but I would love to have long curly hair but if you're a curly girl then you know how much hard work it takes to look after curly hair um and I am terrible in terms of like straightening my hair I just like to straighten my hair and have this like sleep back look um and then just keep it in like a low bun for work um, but because I do have a lot of heat on my hair and obviously colour my hair, I really need to start taking care of it. And these two products are literally my life lifesavers. Um, these were recommended by my hairdresser Izzy because she also has naturally curly hair and does dye her hair too. Um, so she recommended these and honestly I will never go back. I'm going to keep repurchasing these. Um, so I'm going to show you the first one and this is basically the Redkin one united all-in-one multi-benefit treatment so i basically spray this in my hair every time i get out of the shower um so i just basically make my hair i say make my hair damp but i dry my hair till it's just damp and then spray this in sections of my hair and this basically relaxes my hair a bit so it when i blow dry it it's a bit more straight and easy to manage um and that's what i love about it and also that it just makes my hair like super soft like my hair has never been in such great condition as it is now. Like, don't get me wrong, it could be better. Um, unfortunately, for work, I do have to have my hair up. So that is pretty much every single day, um, which is obviously quite annoying because it's not good to have your hair up all the time. However, this has really been helping me look after my hair. And yeah, it just makes it so much easier to manage. Um, and it tames my hair as well. Um, so when I blow dry it, rather than looking like a lion, it just relaxes my hair a bit so that when I straighten it, it's just a lot easier to straighten. So I really love this and I picked this up. Um, I can't rem remember exactly where I got it from. 
<clears throat> but I will leave a link down below um, to where you can get all of this, um, all of these products that I mention, um, if you want to get them yourself and give them a go. But I did get two of these for the price of one. I just can't remember where I bought it from. Um, I know it was online, but yeah, I absolutely love this. And honestly, this is my holy grail and I've run, I've nearly run out, so I need to get more. And then the next hair product, which I'm obsessed with, and I've seen this on a lot of YouTube videos, and no wonder why, because it literally is incredible. This was also recommended by my hairdresser. But this is the Colour Wow Dream Coat Supernatural Spray. Magically transforms texture, amazing humidity proving powers. So this literally just, it also tames my hair, but it just makes it so soft. Like, I can't believe how soft my hair is after I've sprayed this and blow-dried it. Like, it literally makes my hair really soft. But you're only meant to use this every three to four shampoos. And then, basically, you don't condition your hair. You just spray this all over your hair in sections after you've got out the shower. Let your hair dry naturally. Um, you can use a dryer heat. Um, well, actually, that's a lie. Let me say that again. So... You need to apply heat to this product, I say to this product, but you need to basically blow dry your hair to actually activate the product. So for in, in order for the product to work, you will need to blow dry your hair um, in order for it to basically, you know, relax your hair and sort of help tame it. And yeah, and it just really, really helps. And I also don't have much left. I don't think I've got any left on this one. So I need to get some more of this. I'm sorry if you can't see, but... That's what it looks like. And this is quite pricey. It's not cheap. Um, however, I definitely recommend it and I love it. So, yeah, that's my next product that I love. So, next I'm going to start on with nail care because I don't actually have a lot um, of nail care stuff to show you. I've just got one thing that I want to show you that I absolutely love and I definitely recommend. And it's this little pot here. Now, how cute is the packaging and how small it is as well but this basically is cuticle oil and it's the jessica cuticle oil um i will leave a link down below if i can find it online i'm sure i will be able to but i actually bought this from my beauty salon that i go to um not far from me um because they do my gel nails every now and then and i purchased this but obviously as a nurse i'm not allowed to have my nails done so i only have stick on nails basically when i am off work and not obviously at work and then when I go to work I just take them off but this definitely helps with keeping my cuticles nice and healthy and helping with the growth and the packaging is just lovely and this was really inexpensive I have three of these because I keep one in my car and um one in my car and then one in my makeup bag and my um, bag and then also one in um on my office space just so I can top it up when I go along um, but yeah, I really want to send one of these to Shannon, but my only worry is it's, it is very greasy and I'm just really worried about it leaking and I'm not sure if I'll be able to send this. I think I will be able to um, because obviously sending stuff to Australia is quite strict, so um, I need to be careful with what I send. However, um, I definitely want to send Shannon one of these because I know she is into her nail care as well. And then the next three products I'm going to show you were in my gift box from Shannon that she sent me um, and I'll leave a link down below to that video um, it was so fun I loved filming that video um, but she purchased I say purchased she gifted me some stuff um, and I honestly can't get enough of these products so the next one is something that she always talks about and it's the all natural woohoo deodorant anti chafe stick I love the name woohoo as well and I love the packaging as well it's like not massive and this is going to last me forever and it basically is what it says it's an anti-chafing stick deodorant um and it's incredible but i definitely need something that's going to make me not sweat as much um because unfortunately i can be a sweaty person um when i'm on my feet or if i'm at the gym um i mean it's only natural but obviously it's good to have something that really helps with that and being that this is all natural and i'm really trying to stay away from just general antiperspirant sprays because I know they're not very good for you with all the chemicals that they put into your pores. So this has been my favourite the past few weeks and I know that I'm going to love this and it's going to last me forever. Um, but yeah, absolutely love that. So that's a favourite. The next favourite of mine I am obsessed with and 
I definitely want to get some more of this and it's the Lano Lips, the original Lano Stick Lip Balm. Now I'm telling you it is the Australian version of the Rituals Lip Balm that I sent Shannon. It's just so moisturising, it just gives you that really nice natural sheen and I love it, like it doesn't make my lips sore, like you get some lip balms that make your lips so sore and then you have to keep applying it but this doesn't do that literally i apply this maybe like twice a day and that's literally all i need but i love this and i love the packaging as well i'm a sucker for good packaging um but this has been my favorite for the past few weeks i love this um and i highly recommend it so the next product from shannon and i honestly why didn't I try this sooner? Because I am obsessed. In fact, I'm going to put some on now. But it's basically the Sol de Gennaro um, Beige Floor Elastic Cream. But basically, yeah, it's just body cream. And I apply it everywhere because I just love the smell of it. And I love the packaging. And I smell it all day. Literally, I'm walking around and I can just smell it. I love it. And it's like that summery, like... I just, I don't know, I, f I feel like I smell like a vanilla cake, like, it's just very summery, and I feel like I'm a walking cake, like, I just, it just smells gorgeous, and um, that's probably one weird way to describe it, like a walking cake, but you get my drift, like, I just feel like I smell delicious, um, but yeah, look at that packaging, I'm definitely going to buy some more of this, because I am obsessed, and it has been my favourite, I literally put this in my handbag, and I just whip it out, and just smother myself in it. People at work must be thinking, like, what the hell is she doing? Like, applying body cream. Like, literally, I'm, like, pulling it on my arms, at, like, the bottom of my ankles, like, my elbows. Like, I just love this. And I love the scent of it. And this has been my favourite. And I just can't get enough. So the next two products I'm going to talk about are skincare. It's from the same brand. So I'm just going to show you both of them at the same time. Because I've been using these religiously every day in the morning and I love them. So these are from Rituals. If you know then um, in previous videos you know that I like to try a lot of ritual stuff and I'm obsessed with Rituals. They are all natural, they don't test on animals so that is my favourite thing about them is that they don't test on animals and I just love their products in general. Not only is their packaging like stunning um, but I also just love um, the scent, um, the way their products work on my skin, like I've used Rituals for a long time and I know that it works on my skin, it doesn't make me break out, which I love, um, and yeah, I have been loving this, so this is the Ritual of Namaste Glow Pure Radiance Face Oil, so I suffer with quite dry skin, especially around my T-zone, um, so I just love this, I just feel like in the morning after I've cleansed my face, I apply some of this and it just gives me like really natural oily glow and I love it, like I just love it, it's got a little spatula, I believe that's what you call it, and then yeah it just literally, it's it's gorgeous and I love this, um, I know it doesn't look like I've used a lot but literally as one drop goes a long way, um, you don't need a lot of this at all and I did purchase this from the um, Rituals shop in, um, where did I go, Bista Village, so the discounted store, um, and there was a good discount on this, I think it was like £24 if I'm corrected, I can't quite remember, but um, it wasn't that expensive for, I think it's a 30ml bottle, so that's not too bad considering this is going to last me a very long time, so yeah, I love that. And then the next thing from Rituals is this eye cream, I mean, can we appreciate how gorgeous so it's like a marble effect and then the cream and then obviously you've got the eye cream inside and a little bit goes a long way I literally just dab a couple of bits um a couple of dabs under my eyes let it soak in and then that's it um but yeah I've really been loving these products um and this was also discounted at the um discount store um in Bista Village as well so really really love that so yeah, they are my beauty favourites. I'm now going to jump on to my newer purchase. And I thought I'd include it in this video because it is kind of technically like beauty related because it is a makeup bag and it is something new um, to my collection, my Louis Vuitton collection, which seems to be expanding. And I don't really know why, but I just can't get enough of monogram. And I've really been loving like vintage Louis Vuitton pieces. They're just such good quality and I really can't get enough. So I've been like on a monogram frenzy at the moment, just buying 
like a ton of monogram pieces but I wanted a decent makeup bag um something that I can travel with and take away with me and obviously it's Louis Vuitton and it's vintage so I had to get it and here she is so this is my new Louis Vuitton Trues, I believe that's how you pronounce it. Um, sorry if I've pronounced it wrong, but I believe it is the Louis Vuitton Trues 23. So you've got three sizes, I believe. You've got the size 18, which is a lot smaller. Then you've got the size 23, which is this, more of a medium size. And then you've also got the 28, which is quite a bigger toiletry bag, um, which could fit in bigger products in. Um, whereas this is mainly for makeup, and I will show you why and... Um, show you inside and then also show you a couple of my beauty favorites for the month as well but that's what it looks like inside it's got these gorgeous little like bits here where you can put stuff in the compartments like little sections so I've basically got like my mascaras um I've got like my eyebrow stuff um and then I've got some like face cream stuff and this is my favorite tanning lotion which I'm going to show you because this is also one of my favorites but it's the Skinny Tan um, Tanning Face Oil. Um, I love this. Um, I haven't been using it at the moment, but it's basically just self-tanning drops. And it really does give me that gorgeous, like, glow. And yeah, I love this. I think I got this in, like, a, a glossy box or something like that. I can't quite remember, but it came free with something. And I'm literally obsessed with it. I love it. So I keep that in there. And I'm just going to pop that back. And then, yeah, so... It looks like that inside and it's got all of my makeup, literally all of my favourite bits of makeup anyway. Um, and yeah, I am just obsessed with this. Absolutely love it. So basically, I purchased this from an eBay seller, one of my favourite eBay sellers um, on eBay, obviously. And I will leave a link down below to the eBay seller that I use. Um, but it's Brand Street Tokyo, Japan. So I get all of my Louis Vuitton pieces from Japan. Um, and I know if you spend under a certain amount in the UK, then it um, you don't have to pay customs fees, I believe. Um, I didn't have to pay customs fees with this purchase. And it was below £100 for this, which I think is a bargain because the condition of it is just incredible. Like, the brass has sort of come off a little bit um, here. I'm not sure if you'll be able to see, but I have polished it as much as I can. But the actual canvas itself is stunning. Like literally I can't fault it like there is literally nothing wrong with this whatsoever like a lot of the ones that I found on eBay were cracking um the inside was peeling and I really didn't want that I wanted something that just needed a bit of a clean up and I got this for such a good price so I love it yeah literally obsessed so I'm just going to take a few things out and show you I do have one more hair related product that I have popped in here that I really want to talk about and it's called the smooth stick and I think I have mentioned this before in one of my favorite videos but it's basically a smooth stick for your hair um so it's called the ultimate hair taming wand by the brand smooth stick they're on Instagram she's really young it was her first business and she's done so well but you basically just brush it onto your hair to like tame um bits of your hair if you've got like um bits of hair that are just like sticking out this basically just helps tame it and gives you that like sleek back look which I love so really loving this I thought I'd just quickly show you that and it's really inexpensive as well because the got to be one that I was trying to buy is sold out everywhere but I honestly rate this so much more so I'm going to repurchase that then the next favorite of mine are free um I say free but these products were gifted um from Shannon and I can't get enough so they're the Mecca Max and they're like little chubby sticks um but it's basically a contour kit so you've got the highlighter the blusher and then the bronzer and you can basically do face contour um and things like that so yeah really really love these and these I've been using non-stop um they're literally yeah just like a little chubby stick and I love it. I love anything that is more of a cream base, which these are. Um, I love anything creamed base rather than powder. I'm really going off powder at the moment, um, but I have been loving these. Literally, these are my favourites. So they're my new favourites, so I thought I'd show you them. And then the last favourite is a bronzer, and this has been everywhere on YouTube, but I absolutely love this. And it's basically the 
Chanel um, bronzing, it's not really bronzing powder, it's a cream as well, um, cream based, but I love this, absolutely love it. This will last me forever. I had one pot of this a long time ago and it literally lasted me a good few years. So I know this is going to last me a really long time, but I have been loving it. So yeah, that is basically my beauty favourites and my new makeup bag by Louis Vuitton. Now, I can't remember the exact year of this, um, I think it was like 1930, something crazy, like really, really old, um, well over 30 years old, like I couldn't believe how old this was. Um, I have to look on my phone to see how old this was and I'll leave a link, um, a description down below and tell you how old this guy is, but I can't remember from the top of my head, but I know it's very, very old and very vintage, which I love because this had a story, like this belonged to someone and they had their own bits in it and their own makeup and now I'm using it and I've got my own bits in it. And I just love how like vintage pieces tell a story. Um, so yeah, I am obsessed with it and it's my new Louis Vuitton piece. So yeah, definitely a growing collection. So that's going to conclude this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it and if you did, obviously I'd love for you to, to subscribe to my channel. I can't talk. Um, and yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.